The AI Hardware Summit, uh, which uh, I came to for the first time last year, and I found it you know, to be a really nice place to get uh, all the, the nascent industry people involved in uh, developing hardware accelerators uh, together and exchange notes and hear about what people are doing. And you know, this year, you know, there's uh, been a gradual increase in the amount of information that people are starting to talk about. They're starting to talk about their direction and their architectures and their uh, target markets. And so, you know, I wanted to come and see the developments and then talk about our developments also. I was one of the persons who were the early pioneers in the last uh, big transition in computing, the move from single core. Uh, microarchitectures to multi-core multi uh, microarchitectures and that involved a lot of software development. People had to start writing parallel software to take advantage of the uh, uh, architectures. In this move to domain specific uh, architectures, uh, they're meant to accelerate the software that people have already developed using domain specific language frameworks. And so these frameworks are already being used they're already uh, the main way that people develop AI software. So the idea of kind of coming along and accelerating them, you know, will just be a seamless transition uh, of uh, people from, you know, their current set of infrastructure that they, they use to run their models to something that's much more efficient. I think next year we're likely to see some of the companies that started a few years ago start to actually bring out pro products. And so next year I expect to be really exciting because there are companies that have talked about things that they're doing and uh, uh, we'll see you know, what actually happens when uh, their products get into the market and get uh, used by early customers.